Yo, I'm back to you too. I just felt like I should do a prediction for the Alfonso Gomez versus Sal Alvarez fight. Um, for that fight, I have Alvarez winning, possibly by knockout. I don't feel Alfonso Gomez is any better than um, Miguel Cotto, the, the, the popular Cotto's brother. He's actually the older brother by a year or two. Um, the guy, he actually, Cotto actually started off like 30 and 0, just like the other Cotto, you know what I mean? Um, I, I forget their middle names that actually, you know, separate them. But, um, yeah, um, you know, Alvarez, he actually shows pretty good boxing skills. He needs to clean up on his defense. Now, I think he only gets hit sometimes because sometimes he's not as quick as he wants to be. You know, he's, he's a little heavy for his age right now. But, um, Clean up his defense a little bit, man. He's walking apart. He has, he has a Mayweather style, you know, May, Mayweather style fight game. You know what I mean? The, the the way he comes up to fight, his plan to fight, he wants to break the guy down with with, um, with basic boxing skills and fundamentals, and um, and catch him. You know, I don't, he doesn't go in there swinging wild and getting all crazy. You know, that's why he's undefeated. He fights safe. You know, he, he, he makes sure that he's going to leave with the, with the bonus, with the win bonus. All the other guys need to try to take him out. Gomez is going to go in there, try to take him out. And I feel that um, when a, a, a Gomez left uppercut is going to get blocked by Alvarez's left arm. And Alvarez is going to counter over the top of the right, knock him out. While standing on the ropes, Gomez is going to be um, aggressive. He, he's an aggressive fighter. Um, he makes amateur mistakes. And I think um, Sal Sal Alvarez will capitalize on that. Um, I don't. A lot of people want to see um, Sal and um, Manny fight. I heard there was an uh, offer for like sixty million. We'll see if Manny takes that. We'll see. Because we know that Manny don't fight nobody on the winning streak. Especially no no 40 fight winning streak like that. Come on, man. I bet you. Let's make a bet. If Mayweather loses, which I doubt, Pacquiao will fight him. You, you, have, to, you have to lose for Pacquiao to fight you. You know? Um... He, he didn't even want to sign the contract to this Marquez fight, you know what I mean? He, he said $20 million wasn't enough. What do you mean $20 million is not enough? That's all you've been making, you know what I mean? Like, you, you think, you thinking ahead of time, all that big money and everything. Anyway, man, $60 million on the, on the, $60 million on the table for you if I saw Alvarez in Mexico. Let's see if you, let's see if you do it, see if you got the ball with Pacquiao. You know, because last I heard, you was at the end of your career, and you, you trying to look fresh like a 21-year-old. I, I don't know how that's happening, you know. But, um, maybe, maybe you're the Bernard Hopkins of the Philippines or something, you know. But, um, I'll, I'll, I'll let you see on Alvarez fight, um, what's his name, um, Chavez Jr., Julio Cesar Chavez Jr. I actually think Chavez Jr. will get knocked out. You know, he, he's undefeated right now. You know, they say he's getting better. He's getting better, but that's another guy who got caught with steroids in the system and was suspended for a few months. So, um, good luck to both men. I watched uh, Alfonso Gomez when he was on the contender. Um, I thought he was a bum. Um, what, what's that one kid's name? Peter, Peter Manfredi. You know, I, I see that guy every once in a while getting beat up. But, um, it is what it is, man. Let's take Alvarez by knocked out. It, it won't go far. It's about six rounds. And, um, and, and let's go by knock the fuck out. Bam.